Like little warrior to big warrior. Come in. Over. I can hear you loud and clear, little buddy. Not little buddy. Little warrior. If you're gonna play with banana phones, you gotta talk in secret agent code, DK. Uh, I mean, big warrior. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay, okay. Little warrior. <laughs> this is fun. No, it's serious. We're guerrilla agents on a top secret mission sent into the deepest, darkest, most dangerous part of the jungle. Really? Yes, there's no telling what kind of uncivilized, pea brain gargantuan beast could be lurking out there. Why are we gonna steal the banana toy? It's not a toy. Any military genius can see it's really a, a superior eavesdropping device used to secure delicate information from the enemy. Looks like a toy to me. Well, it's not. It's a secret spy device, and I'll need to get my hands on it if I'm gonna get back in King Karul's good books. Hush now. The little fella's coming this way. See anything, big warrior? Not yet, little... Wait. I hear something in the bushes. Me too. It's right in front of me. <laughs> oh, look at this! What do you think it is? I don't know. Maybe it dropped out of an alien spaceship or something. Bet you it's got magical powers. <laughs> you think so? Hey, my banana phone. It's gone. Oh, those no good, dirty, rotten, low-down, yellow-bellied, deep and slime-sucking salamanders! Why would they steal a banana phone? Probably stole it so they could spy on us. Listen in on everything we say. Then let's give him something to really listen to. Oh, you mean like a practical joke? <laughs> yeah. Let's radio them, then hang up. <laughs> oh, that's not gonna teach him a lesson. But I know what will. You're late! Sorry, King Cruel, sir! But we were detained with a, a good reason! There is no good reason for tardiness! Whoa! What is this? It's an eavesdropping device, sir. A bug. I'm not interested in bugs. I'm interested in power. Supreme power. Unlimited power that will make me... Powerful! <laughs> hey, Dickie, what should we do with this shiny new amulet? You mean the one that is even more magical than the crystal coconut? <gasps> more magical than the crystal coconut? Oh, where, oh, where should we put it? Maybe we should hide it uh, someplace like the Forbidden Forest of Congo Bongo. No one will find it. You mean... The lizards? Yeah, King Karul and his cronies. <gasps> Coronas? What's a crony? Oh, it's a derogatory term used to describe heathen henchmen like ourselves who reside in the lowest level of authority. Wait, you two homespun idiots, be quiet! I'm trying to eavesdrop. No one can find out we're hiding this magical, mysterious amulet in the forbidden forest. Pump, crusher! to the Forbidden Forest, immediately! I want that power source! <laughs> oh, what a great practical joke! <laughs> Wait till Cranky hears this one! How many times have I told you not to play practical jokes? We were just having some fun. Every ape with a brain knows that's the amulet of Bugaboogie! Huh? Nothing but pure evil. We're all in danger now. What do we do? You have to bring it someplace. No one will ever go. Go to the Forbidden Forest and hide it in the Well of Woe. Whoa! No way am I going to the Forbidden Forest of Congo Bongo. You have to. The fate of Congo Bongo relies on it. I don't believe it. You're scared. I'm not. I'm just looking out for you, little buddy. Wouldn't want you to get eaten by a bog monster. <laughs> a bog monster? Will you two quit your goofing around and scat? There's no telling what kind of evil has already been unleashed. Now go! And 
Teach him a lesson and keep him out of my fur for a while. If you ask me, Mother, she'll say, oh, he's not so bad. But when I left the house, I took everything she had. I took her silver and her gold and scuffed her wind fan. I even took her aprons and her cover pots and pans. Lying, losing, stealing is the reason I'm a pirate. Ransacking, pillaging, don't knock it till you try it. Blundering and pilfering, make up a healthy diet. Arr, look at me, I'm doing the booty booty. No treasure is too big, I'd scarf the peaks of Kilimanjaro. As well as raise the tomb, I steal the mummy from a pharaoh. I've swiped the crown jewels and burn this crystal ball. But the crystal coconut is the daddy of them all. If you want a job with all the riches you can stand, and all of the security of a great pension plan. Ireland, come aboard! Lion, loot, the sealant is the reason we are pirates. Ransack and pillaging, don't knock it till you try it. Thundering and pilfering, make up a healthy diet. Arr, look at us! We're doing the booty boogie. Arr, from C to C, we're doing the booty boogie. <laughs> what a nice assault. Bad one. Magic amulet. Haven't you found Donkey Kong yet? Uh, almost. Huh? Almost? As in, I'm almost ready to barbecue your sorry carcass? Uh, no, uh, almost as in somewhere between not really and sorta kinda. Don't tell me you're lost. Oh, negative, sir. My keen sense of sight, spell, and direction have yet to fail me. Hip hop, hip hop. Hip-hop! Hip-hop! What you got? A general whose brain can't hold a thought! Oh! DK is a scaredy cat! DK is a... Stop that! I am not! I know! I'm just funning ya! There's nothing to be scared of! <laughs> <laughs> it was me, ya goof! <laughs> That was you? Of course! Who else? <laughs> now quit clowning! I just want to find this well of woe and get out of here! Me too! <laughs> That'll teach him! Teach who what? <laughs> teach DK and Diddy that practical jokes aren't fun! <laughs> Sounds fly! Label the scene for me, ancient relic dude. <laughs> DK and Diddy found this crazy gadget, so I told him it was a magical amulet with evil powers. <laughs> then I sent them on a wild goose chase to the forbidden forest to get rid of it. But the place I sent them to doesn't even exist. Whoa! <laughs> Negative karma, fossil man. What are you talking about? Zen law, dude. What goes around, comes around. You better flex a move to correct, or I'm betting you are regretting. <laughs> Don't be silly. It's just a practical joke. Look. <laughs> practical joke. <laughs> practical joke. I'm duped. And what's more, I'm a clump and crusher in the forbidden forest, running after an amulet that's worthless. When all this time I could have been stealing the crystal coconut in Donkey Kong's absence. <gasps> the crystal coconut! <laughs> Crusher, abort the mission and come back to headquarters immediately. I can't. Why not? Something bad happened. Then find Clump and tell him to get his leathery hide back here immediately. Clump! You don't have to 
shout. Zum. <laughs> oh, hello there, sir. Everything um, under control here. I recall my villain tutorials lesson 109 states, when all else fails, implement and execute heinous diabolical plan yourself! <laughs> hey, how did you fit these little pirate dudes in the Zen gem? Pirates! What? Oh no! They're on the island. I've got to warn Donkey Kong! Far out! Now the joke's on you! Karmic kickback! <laughs> Just watch the coconut, will ya? Whoa! I'm sensing some really negative vibes! Whoa! Jump back, Jack! Arr, I be scurvy, not Jack! And I come in the name of me great-great-great-grandpappy to claim me birthright, the crystal coconut. I gotta tell you, dudes, you are riding some serious negative waves. But you're in luck. I have cosmic jurisdiction to assign mantras. But before I can do that, you dudes will need a major cosmic cleansing and total clearing of the chakras. No offense, uh, but I think you dudes are missing the point. Aye, but you be missing more than that, mate. <laughs> Did you hear that? Did he? Little bud, where are you? Ah, the bud monster! Whoa! No! Go away! Oh, cut it out, will ya? <laughs> There's no such thing as bog monsters. Yes, there is. I saw one when I was just a little monkey. Cranky always warned me not to go into the Forbidden Forest. You must have imagined it, DK. No, I didn't. I know what I saw. In the Forbidden Forest lurks a monster and you'll see how my childhood curiosity got the best of me. With crusty skin and giant claws and dripping fangs and beady eyes, his arms surround you feels like drowning in mud pies. The big Bob monster is coming after you. His terrifying face will make you scream until you're blue. His breath was awfully stinky, it could knock over a rhino. His hair was full of maggots and his ears dripped something yellow. I thought to myself, what could it be? His eyes were red from what I could see. His arms were thicker than a tree. He scared the bananas out of me. The big bug monster is coming after you. His terrifying face will make you scream until you blue. The big bug monster is coming after you. You better run the track to see if he catches you. you the big bug monster is coming after you. Raise a shot, hit the most in the eyes of face. The big bug monster is coming after you. Is a scaredy cat, DK is It a... could have been the bog monster. No, it couldn't, because there's nothing in this forest but you and me. Ah! DK, get to the cabin, Roger! But we haven't found the well of woe yet. There is no well of woe, you knucklehead. I made it up to teach you two goons a lesson. A, a practical, practical joke? joke? You mean the amulet isn't even evil? It's junk! Never mind that! Scurvy and his henchmen are on the island! You gotta hurry before... Oh, no. Blakey, what's wrong? The crystal coconut. Someone must be messing with it. It can only be... Scurvy! <laughs> Hold it right there, soldiers! I demand you hand over that, uh... That magical thingamajigger. Give it to him. It's worthless anyway. Okay, here you go. We're leaving now. We don't want to be eaten by the bog monster. Do you see that? I am a military genius. What do you say, Crusher? What's a bog monster? Oh, it's a big, ugly, hairy beast that eats anything in sight. <sighs> Don't worry, I'm here. The crystal coconut is... Uh, gone! Too late, hero dudes. 
the scum dudes with bad karma already took it. But if Scurvy has it, then he's probably on his ship getting ready to set sail. And if he's got the crystal coconut, then he's got Cranky. We gotta bust a move, DK. Funky's plane. Well, pathetic, dude. Where am I? Hey, what's all my stuff doing here? Cutlass, scurry, crunk, load the rest of the booty and prepare to set sail! Scurvy, he's got the crystal coconut. Now, Deep Kong better get here soon or I'm stuck with these goons. All right, you knuckle-dragging throwbacks. Hand over the coconut. True that, villain dude number two. Pirate villain dude number one beat you to it. Of all the low-down, dirty, rotten, yellow-bellied, slime-sucking tricks, that was my idea. <sighs> this negative stuff is bumming me out big time. Well, I'll just steal it back. After all, there's nothing Scurvy has that I don't have. Except a hand cannon. Well then, I'll need reinforcements, won't I? Oh, don't be silly. Any halfwit can tell the difference between a plane engine and a bog monster. Whereas that is clearly a bog monster. Bog ah! monster! Get out of there this instant! We need to get the crystal coconut. Do I have something better, sir? A retrieve the amulet. That piece of junk is as useless as you are. Oh, no, sir. It's magical and mysterious. Only a complete moron would believe that. Button down the hatches, mateys! <laughs> Who cares that the pirates have the coconut? After all, it's really this mysterious magical amulet. That's the real power source. More booty. If only I knew where to find it. I just hope they don't come to the forbidden forest to look for it. <laughs> well, there's no smarter pirate than me. Butts back up there and follow Scurvy. He just left to meet Carol, and he's got the crystal coconut. Where to, Seaman? Uh, thank you. To the Forbidden Forest, Scurvy! No can do. Oh, not again. What are you talking about? When DK was a kid, he thinks he saw a bog monster. I didn't think I saw! There's no such thing as bog monsters. Oh, yeah? Tell that to the one I saw. That was me that day, you big goof. What? I told you to stay out of the Forbidden Forest, but you wouldn't listen. So I had to find some way to make you stop. So there is no bug monster. That's what I've been telling you all along. So can we go now? We sure can, little buddy. There's nothing to be scared of now. Arr, okay, you lard back landlubber. Hand over the amulet. Oh, no. It's a nasty old pirate. Okay, you in. I be wanting all the booty. The crystal coconut, too. Give it over. I would, but your hands are full. Allow me to relieve you of the hand cannon. Oh, why, thank you, mate. All right, you uneducated piece of vermin. Grr, that be a nasty trick. Are you sure this is gonna work? It fooled me, didn't it? Just wait for my cue, then do your stuff. So, you hand over the cannon, and I give you the amulet? No! Keep the cannon! I only want the crystal coconut! Well, who gets the amulet? Who cares, you imbecile? Run for your life! It's the Bog Monster! The Bog Monster! Run! Run for your life! You get you! Who cares about the booty? Give me back me hand cannon! And then there was one. <laughs> run, run, run for you! Huh? Uh-oh. 
Nice try, Donkey Kong. But as you can see, the one with the most toys wins. And that's me! Not for long. Look at you standing there, so foolish, so helpless, so pathetic. You can't do anything, because I hold the ultimate power source. Great job, little buddy. You sounded so convincing. What are you talking about? I was waiting for your cue. <laughs> I knew he'd fall for it. <laughs> huh? Ah! The bomb monster! Ah! Oh no, crush a look! The bomb monster! He ate King Karoo! Everything except in his head! You idiot! Get me out of here! Thanks to Diddy's Bog Monster impression, it's not likely we'll have to worry about seeing the pirates for a while. Bog Monster? <laughs> I'm glad I'm over that. Ah! Ah! Funky! He's still in the barrel! Funky, are you okay? Maxed and relaxed. All those negative vibes burn me out, so I decided to just chill and clock some Z's. Hey, little dude, you found my hood ornament. Hood ornament? I lost it on my last barrel run, but now I got it back. <laughs> That's karma. What goes around, comes around. You got it, dudes. Later. <laughs> Don't you get it? <laughs> now the joke's on us. <laughs> <laughs> Ha, 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 ha!